Okay. So this is my cabinet and um it's all clean sanded now. I went ahead and did the drawers actually and they're all completely clean, sanded down. I washed it down with water and everything. And so I'm going to use the kills right here um, to go ahead and put the primer on so it takes care of it. And of course, my wacky dogs won't let me film video because they're busy. Bark Rocky, would you be quiet, Rocky, please? Thank you. Well, some, sometimes they listen. Anyhow. So um, I'm going to apply a coat of the kills and you'll see um, what it should be so it'll cover it all up and just kind of I'm going to use a roller and a paintbrush. So here's my clean paintbrush and here's my recycled roller. So I'm going to use it just for the primer. I don't mind using this little cheap little foam roller. I mean, these are real cheap and they're disposable. I mean, you can wash it, use it a couple times, but that's about it. Uh-oh. So um, we'll have that. So I'll film later as I go ahead and I do the cabinet. But here's what it looks like so far. This is our progress. And um, let me see. And of course, I could have a, uh, and I stirred up my kills actually because it was kind of, you know, I've used this quite a lot. So it kind of gets been sitting for a while. And I probably should be I'm gonna do it kind of the I don't know lazy way and just get in here and do just pick up some like this without using the little paint thing and get in here and just roll it which I think will and this top I don't know if in the last video it, I had said that it was like a laminate top but I sanded it so it should take I'll probably put two coats of the primer on it just to hold paint on there but it's it's pretty good I mean it's it took really well with the sanding so I think it'll do pretty good but yeah I mean you can use your own paint can or you know one of those paint things but I don't know for primering you know I just just go in there with a brush and just kind of do what I need to do but the roller I think covers it the quickest and it does these these little cheap ones actually do a pretty good job you know they're small for little cabinet work like this one so it's kind of pretty good the only thing i have to do is combat the mosquitoes out here and any bugs that fly that kind of get on this thing because that's a problem out here there's a lot of mosquitoes right now and so you know they get caught in the paint and they're a little pain but other than that i mean should go pretty easy. I'm gonna get on this side and show you. And you know, as I'm even here, let me tell you, don't use any flip flops or shoes or clothing because this paint I can feel it jumping off of here, jumping onto my feet. I mean, and I'm wearing flip flops right now, so I mean, I really don't care about these ones. But if you do care, I would definitely would not use your designer flip flops or your favorite pair to redo a cabinet because if you think you're going to get away without getting it on your shoes you're not so it, it even micro little particles get on there and you'll have splash but I'm just going to do this lid and then I'll show you the finished product actually when I am all done but this looks pretty good I mean this is a pretty good one coat of primer so that's pretty good right there okay so we'll get back to this video when uh this thing's all finished and then we'll be ready for paint 